Hi guys, welcome to my channel, welcome back to my channel, I'm Bella and today I'm just going to be doing an update on my cloudy review and letting you guys know how I feel about it and answering the questions that you guys asked in the comments. I did answer a few but just in case you didn't see my response or whatever, I'll be answering a lot of things in this video and hopefully this helps you out. So we're just going to get started. <laughs> Just a quick disclaimer, by no means am I a professional, I just am kind of educated on this topic. Uh, please don't flame me for, you know, pretending I know everything about this. I don't, but this is just my perspective on what my doctor has educated me about this topic and yeah, hopefully it helps you guys. I have this notebook of a bunch of things that I'm just going to be answering. So one of the most Thing I got asked in the comments was how long it took to arrive and I did mention this in the video but it took about three weeks to arrive and it just came in my letterbox. I expected it to take a lot longer than three weeks because just in videos that I had watched about it they said it took like a month and a half to arrive and I was like oh yeah it only took me three weeks which is super good and I noticed in the comments a lot of you guys were saying that it still hasn't arrived and it's been like a month for you. I just recommend kind of reaching out to them because um, your package may have got lost or maybe they're just behind, you know, COVID and everything. Like you should expect kind of delays. The next thing that I got asked a lot was, is there an age limit? There's no age limit to buy it because uh, there's no nicotine or anything in it that is harmful to anyone. Obviously, you're not going to give like a six year old this, you know? Like, I do recommend it kind of for just teenagers and up. It really depends on, you know, you. But yeah, so no age limit. Another thing you guys were wondering is, is it harmful? The answer to that is no. It has nothing in it that is going to harm your lungs or harm anything in your body. Yeah, like, it is not harmful at all. It's safe. There's a whole bunch of science behind it. If you want to go on their website and read about it, they have a whole bunch of stuff just saying that, like, it's not harmful. Like, there's no drugs, nicotine, or anything addictive in it. Um, it's perfectly fine for you. It's just a better way than taking tablets. Like, it gets in your bloodstream quicker to help you fall asleep faster. So, yeah. A few people were confused in my comments section asking, do you, like, inhale it? Or, like, what goes on there? So, basically, you want to take a breath and hold it in your mouth for about three, four seconds. And then you wanna breathe it out through your nose. That's the most effective way for it. Yeah, so a few people were like, oh, she's not like breathing it in, what a waste and all that stuff. But you're not actually meant to like kind of inhale it into your lungs. You're just meant to kind of hold it in your mouth for a few seconds and then breathe it out. As I'm going along, I'm just crossing out what I've spoken about. Another question that I got was, does the vapor smell? So like what you breathe out, does it smell? Yeah, it does. It smells like, like a lolly kind of grape. It's not very strong though. Like if you buy this and you don't want your parents knowing something like that, it's not gonna like hot box your room or anything. It just smells like candy. That's yeah, it just smells like a grape candy. Okay, the next question I'm gonna answer is where do you buy them? So they have a website, it's cloudy.com I believe. Um, I'll have it linked in the description and you can just Click on that and then have a look at their website. Another thing that I noticed was there was a few of you guys asking if, you know, it would help you like if you have insomnia or if you just kind of struggle to get to sleep or anything. Yeah, it would, I suppose. Um, but with people with insomnia, it might not help like as much as people who just kind of struggle to get to sleep. But if you are going to take it and you have insomnia or you struggle, you need to make sure that you're doing all the other steps of going to bed because melatonin is like it's a kind of signaling thing like your body releases it to let the rest of your body know that like you know we're getting tired now and all that stuff so if you really want it to work the best it can you want to be like off your phone off like your technologies before you go to bed like an hour and you want to take it at the same time every night and well within the same time about an hour you know every night and just really making sure that you're giving its best opportunity to work. Yeah, I hope that kind of makes sense and helps you understand like what's going on and 
why it's working. And then I noticed someone in the comments said that theirs had a little bit of a brown liquid coming out of, you know, where you breathe in. So did mine. It's kind of, if you have a little bit of saliva or something, it's just the vapor getting stuck on the end. It's nothing to worry about, just wipe it away. It's just the vapor kind of chilling at the top. So yeah. Another thing in the comments was that people were asking how to convince their parents or how do they tell their parents like, you know, they might think it's a, just a vape and it's going to hurt you or whatever. I just kind of told my dad about it and that, because I used to take melatonin tablets and they didn't really do much for me. Um, so I was like, oh, I'll give this a try. And honestly, I just kind of educate them on what it is and show them the website and that it has no nicotine, no nothing in there that's going to harm you. And just kind of explain everything to them and help them understand that it's not... A vape it's a personal diffuser that has um, some herbs and stuff in it and melatonin which is what your body naturally produces and that it's just a natural kind of thing with just a mechanism that makes it vapor so that's kind of a dulled down way to explain it and hopefully like that'll help your parents you know understand that it's perfectly fine for anyone to have but yeah just get them to have a look at the website and read about it and hopefully they'll come around i think that's kind of it for answering you guys's questions now i'll kind of tell you how i've been feeling about it and any problems i've had here's mine basically i don't really have any bad things to say about it like so yeah i haven't had any problems it's really helped me i'm just taking seven puffs you know before i go to bed you know roughly the same time every night and just it really kind of sets you in the motion like yeah i really want to go to bed now yeah i don't really have much to say like about it like it just has helped me heaps and i would 100 percent recommend it to people who struggle to get to sleep and you know maybe if you take melatonin tablets or anything like I feel like this works better. It's been really helpful for me personally, and I hope it helps you guys the same. But yeah, that's all I really have to say about the Cloudy Diffuser. If you guys have any more questions, just make sure to comment them down below, and I will do my best to answer them. I really hope this video helped you kind of understand and answered your questions. If it did, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And comment down any more questions you have and also any video suggestions that you'd like to see me do. And if you kind of enjoy my videos, make sure to subscribe. That really makes my day. And I love reading you guys' comments. Like if you just have anything to say, you know, just comment it and I'll read it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and hopefully I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! I was 13 when I lost